I've got my coffee and my shirt that says coffee is my spirit animal. Cheers! Hi everyone, so today I have a home decor haul for you. My room is actually quite um, white and neutral and I'm, I like to have it that way so that I can just dress it up with colour or like little pops of accents and I like to change up the decor in my room based on the seasons or based on whatever I feel like um, represents uh, my mood at the moment so yeah let me just share with you what I got this huge bus and this is from IKEA and this is I think um, $15 it has that Scandinavian vibe to it but at the same time very simple very minimalist I like to put flowers or what I've done recently is to put um, cotton in here so it looks really pretty like this I would put eucalyptus in here as well and it will just kind of brighten up the room right away. Right away, right away. Next thing that I got is a candle and I honestly got this very recently because I saw it on Instagram and I was really excited to see that a store in Singapore carries it. Actually two stores carry it and I'll put the info in the description bar below. This is the PF Candle Company and it's made in California with 100% soy wax. This is the color number 21, Golden Coast. It's a really nice subtle scent. I'm very sensitive to smells because I get migraines very easily. And when I was burning this one, it didn't smell as strong. So the scent is really nice and light. Yeah, it's very, very, very subtle. And um, yeah, it's a beautiful beautiful candle the glow that comes out of this amber bottle is so nice so right at my dresser is beautiful I love it next I have succulents and with the succulents come the containers that I bought to put the succulents in and first one is this one and this is also from IKEA they have a darker gray color but this is the white one and this plant I also got from IKEA can you see it yeah, it's really cute. And the next few succulents that I got are from my local grocery store and it's from cold storage. So the first one, it, I put two succulents into one. This is a candle votive that I've had for quite a long time. So I just kind of used it to put um, the succulents in. The next one, uh, this particular, I think, is this a milk jar or something from Ikea? Well, it was on discount, it was 90 cents. So, I mean like, why not, right? I got this and it fits this medium-sized succulent perfectly. So I really like this. I think it's super pretty. Yeah. And the next two, the holders are actually the IKEA handle candle holders that were yellow, but I just painted them white and so that it will fit into the whole theme. And these plants are also from my grocery store and they are super pretty. And you can get them in um, plant nurseries and things like that. And they are really inexpensive, so it's a very good way to kind of just brighten up the room and yeah, it's one of my favorite plant things to have. Next, we have a pillowcase from IKEA. This pillowcase is um, $6.90. It's one of the most affordable pillowcases in IKEA at the moment. And yeah, I think it's really pretty. It matches the whole vibe of my room which is the whole neutral thing going on and it's quite a big pillow. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this at home or bring it to the office but at the moment it is on my bed. And then we have a Turkish towel. This I got when I was on vacation in Switzerland and France and this was at a flea market. Was it a flea market? No, it was at the morning, those morning markets at Annecy in France. There were like tons and tons of all these colors and Turkish towels and stuff like that. So it was really pretty and I didn't bring anything to kind of put um, for swimming and stuff like that. So this was perfect. I think it was 10 euros. I should have bought more. I really regret not buying any because buying them in Singapore, I don't know firstly where to find them. And secondly, they are quite pricey. Usually for swimming, I bring either this one or like um, a tapestry that dries really quickly. Yeah, but um, I was really happy with this. Right now it sits on my bed and it gives my bed a very nice accent. So the last thing that I want to mention is my cup. And this is a, sorry, it's a little bit wet because I have coffee in here. But this is just a um, gold and white cup with a reindeer on it. 
and it's super pretty. I, I'm using this every morning to drink my coffee now. And I got this at NSC as well, one of the really pretty little stores that sell a lot of the um, homewares. I can't remember the brand. Oh, it's called Ma Maison du Monde. Am I butchering that? Maison du Monde. Uh, it's porcelain. Yeah. And it's microwave safe but not dishwasher safe. Like you need to know, right? <laughs> but yeah, I'll put the company that it's from below so that you guys can check it out. They have really pretty designs, really pretty things and they are very affordable. I think this was about 5 euros. And um, my husband got another cup which I will insert the clip somewhere here and it looks like one of those old school tin can kind of cups which I found really cool. They have like tiny 1 euro um, beer jugs for shots and like it's so cute. Um, I wish Singapore had a store like that. The truly last thing that I got are um, lights and these are just copper wired lights. So the first one it's just copper wired lights with light bulbs. Yeah, and as you can see, this is powered by a USB cable. To be honest, I haven't tried it out, so I'll let you guys know and insert a clip here to uh, show how it actually looks like when it's connected to a USB. I mean, I don't know if it will be strong enough or powerful enough, but it will be great if you could use this because then you don't have to power anything up. No batteries, no nothing. And the next one that I got has batteries. Yeah, so this I already have and I've already put up one string along here. So you guys can see, but um, I thought that my room could use a little bit more fairy dust. And yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. If you like these kind of videos, do give it a thumbs up. It would mean a lot to me and let me know that you know I should make, continue making these kind of videos. Also, do subscribe if you haven't. I would love to have you here and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye!